All right, guys. Uh, this is it. So, um, I got myself a bunch of high potions. So, this is number one. Number two, uh, everybody is uh, full health and uh, they are level 22, so I grinded a little bit. Um, and I kind of uh, I kind of do it the, the cheesy way, so each time you enter a new screen, there's like an autosave. And if I don't if I don't defeat the boss, I can just simply um, quit the game and reload from this point here on. So even if bad things happen, it's not that not all is bad, so I can just grind two levels more. Um, the important thing here, I read, on, read up on the um, on the boss here, and just to see um, which level he got, and um, it kind of spoiled me a little bit. Um, his weakness, and his weakness is um, thunder. So, good thing that I have uh, Bizaga here. Uh, ah, fuck! Oh my god, it's not uh, thunder. I'm, I'm uh, uh, yeah, whatever. I need. Um, I have some thundera. Which is okay, and I have the Scholar, and I think I have one or two Zeus's Wrath, so this, you remember the Scholar does double the damage uh, of, uh, of items, and uh, double the amount of heal as well. So, I think we're in a, in a decent spot. Let's uh, tackle this boss here. I want that crystal, man. Crystal of water, it is time for you to regain your light. Okay. Man, the music. So ominous. Look, the crystal is regaining its light. It is now your turn. You must merge the light within you with the with the one within the water crystal. Only then will the crystal regain its true light and banish the darkness from its world. Then time will flow once more. Okay, got it. Look out! What? Oh. No, Priestess. Arya, no! It seems luck is on your side today, Warriors of the Light. Oh God. I am Kraken, tasked by Lord Xan to steal the light from the crystal of water. And you, you are all about to die. Man, the art design of, of these, these enemies is just, it's just awesome. So, I really have to be careful here. Um, this guy is pretty tough, so... Luneth, uh, he, he is, he's packing, man. He's packing a pretty, pretty tough punch, so I just attack him. Um, I still got the defend ability, the passive one, for Ingus, so this is good. And with those guys, dude, I immediately get into the, into the rear. Okay, it was a critical, but still, man, this is this is tough. But look at the damage here, 700? Not bad. For like a thousand damage. Um, okay, I need to attack here, man. With Rifia, I definitely need to heal Luneth. And with Ark, come on, man, use that magic of yours. Okay, not bad, not bad. Oh, he flips blind as well. The thing is, I want to use the Zeus's Wrath once. Um, because it does so much damage. I think what I'm gonna do now is I'm just being careful here. Um, blind on, on Ark is no problem, but I think I would just use the high potion on him, just in case, just in case. 
And with Raffia, I use, um, he uses Mallet, uh, Wrath. He uses Mallet. Uh, Thundara, okay. Let's see. That's what I'm talking about, dude. That's what I'm fucking talking about. Okay. Definitely need to heal. Need to heal up here. So I think... I will heal with both Ingus and... With Refia. Luneth, Refia heals Ingus. Yeah, yeah, and Arc will damage. Very good. So this round is probably safe. Unless he's got some, some pretty nasty other spells, I don't know. Uh, like this one. Oh, whew. Ha! I'm so lucky he attacked, he attacked uh, Ingus there, man. Holy smokes, okay. Uh, one second. But it's only for, yeah, I thought it was for the whole group. Um, it's a little bit uh, problematic here. I really need to, need to keep going. So I will just heal. I will just heal myself. And I will heal Raffia, yeah. I need to keep going here with the damage. It's important. I think this is a problem, man. Nice. Shit! No! Ah! Oh, I need to heal Lunes. Fuck! Not, not Riffia. What? What? Dude, I told you. I, I tell you, this was the the Zeus Wrath, man. One one point seven k damage. All right, this 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 made this boss somewhat easy. 5,000 5, gil, nice XP, Ingus gains a level, cool. Oof. Aria. The crystal has regained its true light. Thank you. I... you must take this. The... the power of water. Arias blessed you with the power of water. Dude, so early? I mean, I just got the, 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 the fire crystal. Aria, be strong, you can't leave us. N no, it's too late for me. You, you must go. Promise me, promise me you will banish the darkness and restore peace to the world. Promise you, my lady. Aria. Aria! <laughs> this reminds me of, uh, of Sylvester Stallone. Hey, Julian! An earthquake! We have to get out of here! Watch out! Ah! Yeah, but this boss battle was somewhat easy then, with the Scholar. The scholar is not that bad, to be honest. If you have these... These big items, it's not, it's not bad. What now? Warriors of the light. <laughs> okay. You must seek out Doga. He is the only one who can help you defeat Xand. Seek Doga. On the continent of Dalk. Dalk. Whoa, what? When? How? Where am I? We're in Amur, the city of water. Grams found us in the temple and brought us here. 
We had been asleep for three straight days, and the world has changed much, much in that span. No one here remembers having their time stopped. It's as if they've never happened. Alright, um, let me check this. So, so, um... Okay, okay, okay. I got a decent amount of gill. Which is good. Let me give you a brief description of your jobs. Monks are very resilient. Dude, I already got that. Um, knights take pride in their high defense. Their defense ability allows them to step in and take damage from weakened allies. Yes. And they can use white magic too. Scholars can examine enemies and spot their weak points. They can also enhance the effects of items they use. They can dispel magic effects from enemies they have studied. Surprisingly enough, these bookworms can also use magic. Alright. could stock up on some high potions, maybe like five. I uh, think the other ones I'm good. These are greens, yeah, alright, I think I'm good. Is that your ship in the cove? I saw that Goldor locked it down with a giant chain, so it wouldn't be going anywhere soon. Goldor? Legend says that four warriors from the land of darkness came forth and subdued the overflowing light. Goldor is afraid that you four are those warriors of legend. He put a chain on your ship to stop you from getting to this crystal. Oh, I still need to, to get to the crystal then. Okay, okay, okay. I got you. I hear that everything in Goldor's manor is made of gold, but he's so afraid someone might steal them that everything's under lock and key. What? <laughs> I like this little... Things here. <laughs> Fantabulous! Yes! Super good. Alright. What up, Gramps? I don't know, he does it, but I hear that magic bounces right off of Goldor. Oh, this is good info. You can't cross the bottomless bog unless you have le what? Levy grass shoes. I think Delilah owned a few of those. You can find her in the sewers. So if this, um, so either I have to own attack with physical, or um, he has something like a shell that protects him from from magic damage. Uh, where where is the way out? Yeah. Alright, you know what? Let me just uh, buy some, some stuff here, man. I need to buy some stuff. Probably pretty expensive, yep. So the Viking Helm I cannot use. I saw that there's a Viking job available, I think, uh, when we once we gathered the, the crystal. So, this is this. Um, thief gloves, no black garb. Ooh, for Luneth. Hmm. Black cowl, also for Luneth. Black belt G. Also for Luneth. Wait. Uh, then I don't need the black garb, right? Chakra. Then I only need those things. But before I do this, um, just buy, th buy this one here. Because I want to see what else is there. Chakra band. Alright. If I have enough gold at the end, then I will buy it as well. What is here? Battle Axe. Holy shit, 65 damage. Main gauge. Gauge? No, yeah, no. What is this? Gosh? Gosh? Uh, Thunder Spear. Celine Bow. Um, 16,000? Boomerang? Um, one, one thing though. I really need to... Whoa, what? I, I, whoa! I have the new jobs. I have the new jobs. Le guys, look at this. Dragoon, Viking, Dark Knight, Evoker, and Bard. All right. Um. Uh, so I really have to get into those those things again here. Um, I know that the Dark Knight is probably pretty good. Um, I really need to read up on on those jobs here before I before I take them. 
So I think it's probably good to end the episode now and to see which jobs is, uh, are best. And then in the next episode, uh, I will talk a little bit about those jobs, what I did, and then we can continue with uh, with the equipment and uh, we're going on with the story. I really, it's really interesting. Um, we took like five hours to to acquire the the fire crystal, and maybe like one hour to for the for the water crystal. And I think there's only one crystal remaining, right? So yeah, it's really interesting. Let me just get to the world map here. I want to save. Aha, uh -huh, here. Here it is. So... Yeah, this is... This is the same world. Yeah, okay, okay. Just a little bit more... Nice. Okay. Let me save this shit. Yeah, um... I will end the, the episode now. And in the next episode, as I said, we will continue with the main story. We will, um... Talk about those jobs, talk about equipment, items... And whatever. And, um... Yeah, so, thanks for watching guys, hope you have a great day, and hope you liked the, the episode as well. I really, really enjoyed it, so take care.